Well, my name is Phil Cockleff, and I'm curator of the herpetology department at the Knoxville Zoo. There are only two venomous snakes in East Tennessee. Um, there's timber rattlesnakes and copperheads. That's it. There's, there's nothing else. People will argue till they're blue in the face that there's water moccasins or cotton mouths, which are the same thing, and they are not. Um, so the only two venomous snakes in East Tennessee, once again, are timber rattlesnakes and northern copperheads. Um, timber rattlesnakes are really easy to identify because they have a rattle. I mean, there's nothing else in the world has a rattle but a rattlesnake. And um, they're even born with that. So that, that's a no-brainer. If you can identify that one, um, then all that's left is a copperhead. And here I have a model of a copperhead. Um, we have a northern copperhead that um, that looks like this a whole lot. Um, the colors are off a little bit, but the distinguishing feature of a copperhead is these bands. And the deal with these bands is they're real narrow on the midline, and they're real fat down either side. So they look like um, saddlebags or hourglasses. Um, all the way down the back, and without exception, um, all copperheads have this pattern. Kind of mountainous areas when you start seeing both copperheads and timber rattlesnakes. You're probably not going to find a timber rattlesnake where there's a lot of people. Copperheads are a little more gregarious. They, they live a little closer to human habitation. There's only been, I think, three reported actual incidents of copperheads in Knox County. There are venomous snakes in the world, but no such thing as poisonous snakes in the world. Poison is something you ingest that you eat. Venom is something that's injected. 90% of all venomous snake bites occur from somebody messing with the snake. Snakes will not attack people. Snakes are not going to chase people. They, they want to get away from you as badly as you want to get away from them. of encountering one in, in Knox County especially are, are virtually none. Um, there are a lot of non-venomous snakes in, in East Tennessee and, and honestly very few venomous snakes. Um, if you are to see a snake in your yard, whether you know for sure it's venomous or non-venomous, or there's, there's so many mistakes made by people that my advice is to just um, leave them alone altogether, treat it like any other wild animal. And, um, and just give it a good a good distance and, and leave it alone completely. I mean, they belong here. I mean, they belong here. They're they're supposed to be here, and um, they they really do serve a purpose.